got the idea for this when I saw these tabletop bins on sale very, very cheaply. And I was making a lot of activities to link with my new book, Booklicious. What you need in addition to a little plastic bin is some of the um, foam sheeting and a couple of polystyrene balls for the eyes, some googly eyes, some glue, a pair of scissors and a pair of 100 denier tights. 100 denier tights don't matter. First the eyes. For the eyes you use the towels of the tights. But before you actually cover the eyeballs, the polystyrene balls with the tights, you need to just slice part of the polystyrene ball off so that you've got a flat edge. And then that will stick quite easily. Stretch the toe of the tights over the polystyrene ball, twist and secure at first with an elastic band. Make sure it's really tight. Then you can stick the eyeballs onto the top of the little uh, table tidy and add some googly eyes. A strip of red foam for the mouth and I stuck that um, inside and outside. Then take the leg of the tights and pull that over the bottom of the table tidy. You don't need to leave it much either end and uh, we'll cut it and stick it later. So the top and bottom fit together. You need to snip the uh, tights around the edge and then we can push that down and glue it to the container. Now for the froggy feet, cut out four because you need two for the hands and two for the feet. Stick the hands onto the top and now we need to cover the base to secure it and hide obviously the label uh, with just a piece of any colour or uh, foam. Stick that on well so that you can't see where you're stuck on the hands just cut a strip of the green foam and stick that around the top. Get the kids to stick on lots of little sparkly speckles so you've got a speckle frog and attach the feet at the bottom, put the top on, and there you have your froggy tabletop bin. Lots more fun froggy craft ideas and froggy facts on this playlist and my website. <laughs>